Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Project Zomboid meets Seven Days to Die. We're on episode eight here. Just filling up our Mustang, filling up the generator with some fuel. We are going to go on a little road trip today. Hopefully get some extra supplies, some extra guns, ammos, all the goodies, and maybe even some new weapons would be pretty sweet. Uh, we're not really going to bring too much supplies. I don't think there's anything really in the car, but we're going to leave everybody here to protect the place, and we are going to head out. Uh, let's see. Just going to find out where we want to go. So we're all the way over here. We could go to any of the other cities, which would probably be quite the trip. What about... Huh. Oh, you know what? You know, why don't we go out here to the city? So oh, someone was just screaming. Uh, we've been over here a few times. I know there's some like stores here, but that's so close. I kind of want to go a little bit further than that today. Um, let me pull up the map real quick. Cause maybe we'll come over here. All right. So I think we are going to go over here to this town, Moldro. Um, we, there is a warehouse right here and a couple other spots that we might want to hit up. And we also might spend a few days there if we need to we also have come back for the generator which will kind of suck but um there is going to be hopefully some military stuff that we can snag so we'll try to just spend a day or so there not too long and uh go from there grab as much loot as we can and then we'll haul it all back if we can find a trailer or something that'd be pretty sweet uh we'll meet you guys when we get there well boys we might have to go on foot from here or at least clear some of these vehicles and first we have to clear some z's Take these guys all out. There we go, boys. Holy shit, that was quite a few. And we got more on the way. Ooh, boys, there's an RV. That would be really nice. The only thing is, there's a lot of zombies here. And that's a lot. Ooh, that guy's got something on him. Looks like maybe a shovel. Alright boys, we're just about here, I think. And it sucks there are quite a few zombies here. Yeah, I think the warehouse is right over here. Ooh, there's even a bus. So yeah, we're going to spend a lot of time fighting. Oh yeah. Alright boys, well, why don't we have a little snack and get to work? Oh, all my food's in there. Shit. Ooh, look at this guy. He's decked out. All right, we gotta come back for that stuff. Yeah, we are gonna have to find a way to take these guys out. Hmm, maybe a fire or something. If I can kind of bottleneck them into maybe that fence right there and get away from them. Light it, boys. Light it, boys. Light it, boys. Oh, we just missed it. Shit. Thought we had it. That guy's getting a little bit tired. Alright. Looks like it's clear. Come on. Light, 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 light. Yeah, there we go. Alright, boys. Come on in. The water's fine. Oh, wait, look at them all catching. Oh, yeah. There we go, boys. Get them nice and cooked up. We're going to have a nice zombie feast tonight. Oh, my God. The fucking computer's going to catch on fire after all these guys. Wow, look at that. I can't even turn around. There's so many of them. Zombie BBQ. So anyways, I started firing with fire. All right, boys. Well, the majority of the zombies are dead. Now we just got to drop everything off. Maybe we could get this bus. That would be sweet and tow that to the Mustang back. And then uh, we can uh, start looting a little bit, relax a little bit, give our guy a break. Oh, look at that, boys. Got it right up. Ooh, and it started up. Shit. Not too bad. I wonder how much storage is in that thing. Ooh, the brakes aren't doing so good. Let's uh, let's take a peek at the hood. Ah, could be better. Battery's good. The engine's not doing so good. We'll have to repair that. 
I need some engine parts and a wrench. Let's check the uh, the trunk, the uh, the back, anyways. It's got oh wow 156. That's horrible. All right, boys, come on, you can have your turn. Oh, shoo. Do the 360 no scoop. All right, now it looks like I got everything. All right, boys, we're gonna load this guy up and we should be able to tow one of these. I'm not sure if it's gonna be easier in one way or the other, but I guess we'll figure that part out. Load this all up, almost to the brim. The only thing we got left is our soup. I wanna see if maybe I could tow the trailer with the Mustang because I think the Mustang is a little bit more agile and also in much better condition. But I think the power has a lot to do with the towing capabilities. And we get another friend over here as well. Give him a clunk. Oh my god, yeah, look, we're fucking zooming. Holy shit. We drive faster with the bus than we do without it. <laughs> oh, boys, on the way back, I forgot we got the RV right here. And uh, we found the key in one of the zombies. So we're going to be popping all this stuff into the RV and taking the RV instead of the prison bus. So basically, just going to work on doing all that real quick look at that boys it's so cool all kinds of goodies in here it's awesome we make a little mobile base or something oh and all this stuff stays good because um of the car too it's so cool how do i get out do i just walk this way all right boys I actually just realized right here there's like a trunk and i can fit almost everything in here it's got like 338 spots only have 310 and the rest of the stuff i just put inside so that's pretty sweet we also got this boy hooked up to the mustang and look how fast this thing goes just like the other one Shoo! zooming around oh yeah boys Alrighty, boys, it's another rainy day here in Zomboid land. Uh, we're going to have a little bit to eat and drink, and then we're going to head out, and I think we're going to prepare a little bit for the horde. Then we're going to make maybe a little bit of a, uh, like, a kill zone, like a kill corridor or something like that. Probably in town, just because it seems like there's more we can do if we get stuck. Um, or maybe we'll go ahead up above where we used to be as well. Uh, let's fill up our water as well. All right, so I think I'm gonna make some kind of like fence or something. Um, hmm. I figure that part out and then we will get working on that. We have about a day and a half probably. Alrighty boys, it's just about 10 p.m. We made a little bit of a, ooh, we got over here, Survivor Kirsty. He better get out of here, girly. All right, here comes the zombies. We got a little bit of a base going. Let's get this generator on. We put a generator over here. We have so many, so might as well. Got hooked up with some lights. Uh, turn on. There we go. All right. Made basically just like killing corridor, uh, with some doors out the back, so we can escape if we have to. And uh, hopefully this will slow them down. I haven't tested it, but I'm pretty confident in it. And try to rather gather up as many as we can, and then just basically jump into it once we are ready. And uh, hopefully it works well. There's also a campfire I put here with some wood in case we need to burn some. And then a bunch of lights. So I'll just gather these guys up for a little while. Oh, it looks like they want to go over there already. Oh, oh, she's gonna die. Cause she didn't want to go home. She kind of just wanted to screw around. Well, shit. They love to kill themselves, I don't know why. So I'm over here shooting all these zombies. But there's still like so many dudes just sitting over here attacking the walls for whatever reason. Yeah, so that kind of sucks. I guess that's not going to work very well because they just took out all the walls. Maybe we'll just have to make a bunch of fences. And maybe I can siphon them through this house a little bit.
Also brought out the uh, MP5. I'm gonna use this guy because the shotgun's kind of getting annoying sometimes. You could shoot someone right in front of you and it just doesn't hit them even though it's higher than. See if I can get this fire on. There we go. Now we can have a little cookout. Santa Claus going down the wrong chimney. I don't know, the aiming in this game is kind of getting repetitive and annoying because, like, a lot of the times you'll be killing people and just. Is targeting the wrong person or doesn't even hit him. It's kind of disappointing sometimes. Alright, it's rather quiet. Fire's still lit. Why don't we put that out so it doesn't uh, get wasted? Uh, let's see. Is that fire? Yeah, I think I'm gonna check out the houses because there might be some stragglers. I'm a little bit disappointed. They just attack this for no reason. Kind of sucks. They attacked all the walls and everything. They didn't even come after me, half of them. Yeah, nobody's in here. Sweet. Well, there we go, boys. That is the eighth horde down without, without any issues. Um, the only gripe I have is the aiming. It's just I haven't played in a little while and coming back and the aim is kind of annoying. Um, so I don't know if there's any maybe mods that would fix that. I think I do have a couple aiming mods on. Um, they don't really seem to be working too well, but um, that and then... Um, Kind of sucks with their pathing and attacking the wall. But other than that, it was pretty well well rounded horde. A lot of zombies and it was pretty easy. Hopefully we'll get some good loot. So I'm going to loot up everything now. See if there's anything good. Maybe some guns or something to ammo. That would be great. If not, we'll probably have to do an ammo run very shortly. But uh, yeah, so don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, stay tuned for the next video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.